Why have help and not acknowledge the help? And many times as Christians, we have a helper, but we don't even, many of us don't even acknowledge the Holy Spirit or the Holy Ghost in our lives. We recognize the Father, we recognize the Son, but I remember Benny Hinn wrote a book said, Good morning, Holy Spirit. Yeah, yeah, you need to wake up and you need to acknowledge the Holy Ghost because he's in the earth now and he's in you now. So God has given us everything to live in the anointing. He's given us everything to live an anointed, powerful life. And it's available to every believer. It's not just available to five-fold ministry. It's not just available to the apostles, prophets, and, and evangelists, and pastors, and teachers. It's not just available to the ushers, and the singers, and the musicians. And it's not just available to those who we think are special. Every person has the ability to live in a powerful anointing. I like what John 14 and 26 says, but the helper... The Holy Ghost, whom the Father will send in my name, he will teach you all things. Wait a minute. You mean to tell me I have a helper who will teach me all things? And even those of you who say you don't need a pastor talking about the Holy Ghost to teach me, you haven't even submitted to God for the Holy Ghost to teach you. 